Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, I wanted to show you today how I pack up the 12 Little Companion 1.0. They recently had a sale on their website and I've never tried 12 Little, so I thought I would grab one. I know normally you would see my lovely face, but I've been sick, um, so I'm just gonna show the bag today. Um, I also picked up this little charm when they had their sale. It's a dragon. Um, cause the whole story behind 12 Little is it's about the Chinese Zodiac and the 12, um, different Chinese Zodiac that there are and how each one could represent your little one. Um, none of my children are a dragon, but I just thought the dragon was so cute that I had to get it on the front. Um, I do have this bag tag with Star Fairy, uh, Tokidoki Star Fairy by Perfectly Paired. I'll link her in the description. She makes the cutest custom stuff. Um, so to start off, I didn't expect it to, it's kind of got a bit of a heft to it, but I did, it's not heavy, but it does have like a more of a heft than I expected from a quilted um, bag, the material being like a quilted. It does have the faux leather trim. That is why it's spot clean only. Um, you cannot put it in the washing machine, most likely because of these parts here. Um, so I'm not like an overpacker, but I am about to have to unpack this anyway because, as you guys know, I cloth diaper. Um, my son has to have some medicine right now on him that is not cloth diaper safe. And so we are in disposables, which is very weird for me because I haven't, I mean, I haven't used those in forever. So, okay, so it has the top pocket here. The only thing I actually have in there is fruit snacks because my son constantly wants a snack like as soon as we get in the car. It has a magnetic pocket here, if you can see. And I just have some um, anti-Clorox wipes in there. I'll show you how far down. It goes about that deep that you could stick stuff in it. It then has the zip around, this two zipper pocket here. In there I have my Tokidoki zip around wallet in pool party. And then this is just like my little, this is a small be organized piece by GGB and Camp Toki. And this is kind of like my med kit. I just have some Tylenol, some Band-Aids, nail clippers, uh, lip balm, Neosporin, and face wipes. I always have to take nail clippers because every time I go to Aldi, I break a nail. Like every time when I'm packing my groceries up, I break a nail. But the zippers are really smooth. No catch at all. This one does have a little one up here at the top, but I think that's just because of the way that this hangs down over it and because I keep getting that part stuck. But otherwise, um, they're pretty smooth. Okay, so in the, and it does have insulated bottle pockets on each side and feet on the bottom. And I'll show you real quick, actually, before I open this all up and show you what's in there. There is a, on the 1.0, they did change it on the 2.0, but on the 1.0, there is a zipper pocket down here, hidden right here. And all I did with that is I just stuck, because of the change pad, and I just stuck the change pad up in there. But it's a pretty deep pocket, like, check it out. You guys know I have long arms. But it fits my whole hand, and it goes, you know, from side to side of the back of the pockets, or the back of the bag, so... It's a pretty good pocket. So you can stick whatever up there. You don't have to stick the change pad in there. So I am a pouch packer. So it does have a lot of actual internal organization, which is nice. It has this front pocket right here. It's got the lining of little Zodiac animals that you can see. But I didn't use a lot of the pockets just because like I said, I am a pouch packer. So I have the We Pouch 60 in bolts with our wipes and I had that right in the front pocket there. I don't have anything in the other front pocket because there's two pockets right here on the front. See? And then I have our gapper in Camp Toki and this is the plum color. I didn't tell you that at the beginning. I don't know why it is the plum and it goes amazing with Camp Toki. Um, so this is my dapper. You'll see this in most of my diaper bags because I fit four Plum Genius in there. Free Time and 4.0 is usually what I use, and this is the Grovia Small Wet Bag. And then, so I can take, and that's usually all we need if we're just running errands in town for the day. 
And then I have the Camp Toki Quick Shujubi. And in that, I have an extra outfit both for my 20 month old and my four year old, even though she's not always with us, I just kind of keep it packed in there. And an extra Grovia small wet bag, just in case I have an accident or, you know, they're running around in someone's sprinkler and they need extra clothes, then I have it on me. So that's really, I mean, I'm not a heavy packer. So that's really all I had in there. Um, it does have two elastic pockets back here. And I could fit a lot more in there than I did, but I just don't, unless we're gonna be out like all day, I don't take a whole lot with me because I'm only usually gone for a couple of hours. So, but we know what you think of it. And if you have any questions, you can drop them in the comments below and I'll be sure to answer them. Um, I've done a lot of, you know, jujube videos. So I would say that I think that it's a little bit smaller than the Be Right Back with Juju B, but not by much. Um, I could probably still fit, like when I pack up my Be Right Back, my BRB by Juju B, I usually put like a large organized piece on the bottom with like four more diapers, and I could still, I could still probably do that in here too. Like I could put it right on the bottom and put everything on top of it like I do in the Be Right Back. So yeah, just let me know down below if you have any questions. Um, and like I said, I will drop the link for Melissa, Perfectly Paired. So if you want some custom goodies, um, she makes bag tags and she makes the cutest little charms. Thanks.